my purple banditos, welcome back to more Let's Play Pokemon Platinum. I'm Purple Rodri. In the last episode, we made our way here to Sunny Shore City. In today's episode, we're actually going to go in search of Volkner, like Flint told us, that, that ginger-headed guy from the Elite Four. Yes, so I know you guys recommended for me to go to the bottom right. I still haven't explored this place. Yeah, I'm going to be, oh look, a little Pokeball, and I found a Thunderstone. Okay, I'm not going to flip out over that because I don't really have a use for it anymore. It's not like I have a Pikachu or anything. But yes, you guys recommended me for me to go into the Lighthouse or something. Kind of like the same thing Flint told us. Um, this is it, right? Vista? The lighthouse. Let's go ahead and head up the stairs. We need to go find this Vol Volkner fellow and uh, hopefully, you know, get him to battle us once and for all. I don't know why he's hiding. If I was the 8th gym leader, I'd know that I was kick-ass and that, you know, people are coming to battle me and look, let let's talk to him. This must be this guy right here. So, you're the latest challenger up against the Sunny Shore gym. Alright, I've decided. If I find you to be weak, I'm going to challenge the Pokemon League. I'm all done with renovating the gym, so I don't need to be here. More than anything, I want to have battles that can thrill me again. As the toughest gym leader in Sinnoh, I'm going to unleash everything in my arsenal on you. Okay, that's that's nice of you. Why would he challenge the Pokemon League, though? He's a gym leader. I don't know. Guess he wants a little fame out of it, or something like that. Uh, let's go ahead and head back down, and we're going to make our way back to the gym. Now that this has happened, we can probably enter it and start making our way through there and kick some... Volkner butt. I can't wait to fight this guy. I'm really excited. I'm pretty sure it's the same guy from the anime. So I remember, you know, Ash having a difficult time against him. I do know that he's the electric type gym. So it's going to be a little bit of a challenge. Where is this gym, by the way? Uh, I don't know where this gym is. I, I doubt it's down there because I explored that whole... Oh, look, look, look. Here's Flint. Here's Flint. Let's uh talk. Wait. Sunny Shore City. Okay, this is it. Leader Volkner, the shining, shocking star. Yo, Haya, he's finally come back. He seemed to be feeling a beat too. I have a hunch that he recognized your toughness right away. I bet he's getting excited over the thought of battling you. Remember what you have to do, Hotshot. Give him a battle that's so hot it will reignite his passion for battling. Alright, Hotshot, I'll be waiting at the Pokemon League. Wow, see you later, dude. We're going to be battling him at the Pokemon League soon. Very soon. Once we beat this gym, we're going to make our way to Viridian City. No, okay. Hey there, how's it going, Chef B? Let me check out your trainer case. Let's see how many badges you have. One, two, three, whoa, whoa, you already got seven? That means if you beat this gym leader, you're on your way to the Pokemon League next. That also means this is the last time I get to give you advice. This is it, kiddo. Listen carefully. One last time. The gym leader here is a master of electric-type Pokemon. That's all I have to say. The rest is up to you. All right, the rest is up to you guys. The rest is up to you helping me make my way through here. What is... What the fudge? The fudge? All right, something really weird's going on. The switch rotates the platforms. What? What? Okay. Oh yeah. Okay. Okay. This is not that difficult. I'm making it way too hard. Way too hard. Okay. There we go. That was pretty easy. Do we have to battle this guy? Hopefully we don't. But here we go. We're gonna have to battle him. have some tough trainers like if Cyrus has galactic grunts you think the least that Volkner could do is get some like real mature badass trainers but no I guess not by all means you go for this crappy team and this is very confusing uh, can I head up here all right if I head up here that's gonna lead me down to that trainer you know what I think I have to do it so let's go ahead and face it off against this one too it's a uh, little brown haired one again so while we're doing this in the last video I actually was like oh it's Wednesday no, it's actually Wednesday now, uh, the 28th of September. We're coming up on the end of the month, guys. Are you excited for Halloween? What are your costumes going to be? I was actually looking around on like eBay and stuff, and I was like, oh, I wonder what I should dress up at. And I found a little Yoshi plush hat, which I think would be very cool. I don't know if I want to be Yoshi, though. I don't know, maybe like just like a green shirt and then wear like the little Yoshi plush hat. But I'm not sure if people would understand what it is. They'd be like, oh, are you Barney? And then I'd be like, no, I, I'm pretty sure you you don't know who I am. So, I, I don't know. If you guys, what do you think I should dress up for? Let me know. What do you think I should dress up for? If it's a really good costume, dude, I'm not even kidding. I, I will show you guys a picture. As you guys know, on Twitter, it has my picture. Um, so I went for the earthquake. You think those things would have levitate, but I suppose not. And we KO'd the Magneton. That was quite easy. I need to switch out my lens up front. I keep forgetting to do that. Uh, we KO'd it. So yeah, what are you guys going to be for uh, Halloween? 
I, I think I think a couple of you guys are gonna dress up as uh, really cool things. You should dress up as Pokemon, dude. If one of you guys dressed up as my Pokemon team, oh my gosh. Like, if you have like five other friends that'd be willing to dress up as the, as the Pokemon team, that would be fantastic. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and use Hyper Potions on Speedy and Lens so we can keep going. All right, there we go, Speedy. And now let me go ahead and heal up Lens. Hopefully we are almost to where Volkner is. Because I don't really feel like, you know, dealing with all this crazy stuff. I don't want to be fighting this huge amount of trainers. And that rotated it to here. What is this going to rotate? Oh, okay. That was so easy. We're going to have to fight this guy, though. So let's go ahead and fight him off really quick. And we can finally go up these stairs. These stairs are a Pikachu. No, that's a trainer. I'm not falling for that one again. That little... Oh, crap. I went the wrong way. Oh, jeez. We got to fight this Pikachu. Here we go. girl in her Pikachu costume. Let's head up here, and it seems like we have another one of these mazes to go, dude. I'm getting a little tired of these just because, you know, they're kind of a bit tough. I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to head the other way, but I really don't want to be battling that guy, so I'm kind of wait, going to wait for him to turn around and then start going for it. You know, uh, let's go! Yes, we made it past him. Let's go ahead and press this button. Hopefully, it's sending me in the right direction. I'm kind of tired of battling all these trainers, uh, but it looks like we're going to have to fight this green-haired girl, so let's go ahead and do it very quickly. That was quite easy, and she had a cute little Raichu. I really like Raichu. I don't know why, but since I was little, I always just had a fascination for Raichus. I just always thought that they looked cool. We're going to have to speed through this guy, so let's go ahead and beat him. So here's hoping that this is the last switch, the path that finally takes me to this guy. And I, will it be? Here, let's go ahead and rotate it one more time. Oh, crap, it would have been. No, wait, maybe not. Well, okay, this is this is confusing. There's Volkner right there, but how do I get to him? How exactly am I supposed to get to him through this path? Okay, I come down here, and that doesn't do anything. Let's press the switch again. I'm going to have to head down this path, and that doesn't... What is up with this lightning? Okay, I ran right through it. I was like, oh, jeez, please don't shock me. <laughs> you know, I don't know. Uh, we are very close to getting to Volkner. Hopefully, I can get there soon. We're going to have to... I can't I can't go there. Uh, can I head through here? This is confusing. I am... I'm very confused on what it is exactly that I have to do to get to Volkner. All right, I'm going to go ahead and hit this switch one more time. Head up here. I can't cut through here. Looks like I'm going to have to go down and wrap around. I'm going to have to uh, beat this person. Alrighty then, we should be able to step on something now that we're finally here. Ah, jeez, I just gotta make it past this guy again. This guy is, he's tripping me out, man. He's tripping me out. Oh, no, 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 he's looking for me. You want me, don't you? You want to, me to step on that switch. 
Okay, did that do anything? No. Are we just back where we started? Dude, I'm gonna be so PO'd if we're just like right back to where we began. Uh, let me go ahead and step on this switch again. No, that didn't do much. This is confusing. This is a difficult maze. No doubt about it. This is very, very tricky. Why can I not get past this now? Oh, jeez. Did I step on something wrong? Ah, dang it. I think I might have. I might have done something wrong. Uh, let's go ahead and step down here. That's, that's rotating the stuff. So, why are the bridges not coming down properly now? Did I mess it up? I, I think I messed something up. I really think I did because the bridges aren't coming down properly now. Uh, rotating that flips the bridges the right direction. Um, hopefully, this will be it. Hopefully, this will be good. Let's, let's try and run past it again. And hopefully, something has changed or that I did. Oh, yes! Yes, yes, it's correct. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and heal up really quick. Uh, where's my revives? Where's my ethers? I'm so nervous! It's freaking Volkner! Ah! Ethers! Alright, ethers, ethers, ethers. Let's go ahead and use that one on Speedy. And I'm gonna get his Earthquake back. And I'm gonna go ahead and use a Hyper Potion on Speedy very quickly. And Sparky, you can you can stay dead, Sparky. You can stay dead. We're not gonna really need Sparky for this fight. I'm gonna go ahead and switch out Speedy up in front. And then we will be ready to take on Volkner. So let's go ahead and talk to this guy. And let's go ahead and get it going on. Alright, Challenger. It's not often that some trainers manage to come and challenge me, but they've all been boring battles. I didn't break a sweat beating them. Sigh. I'm Volkner, the gym leader. They say I'm the top gym leader in Sinnoh, but... Anyway, I guess we better get this done. I hope you're the trainer who'll make me remember how fun it is to battle. So here we go, Rodri versus Volkner, gym leader number 8 of the electric type gym here in Sunny Shore City. Are you guys ready? Oh wow, he's standing up for me now. Okay, cool. He's gonna send out a Jolteon. I am gonna open up on my speedy. But this is it, guys. This is our final fight. This is our shining moment against Volkner. I hope you guys are prepared. We've been waiting for this one for a while. And I know I've been excited for this one because I really, 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 really like Electric-type Pokemon. So I'm gonna go for the Earthquake. It should be easy enough to KO this Jolteon. As it's only level 46, and we were KOing all the other Pokemon quite easily, we should be able to sweep through this gym, boom, bada, bing, bang, bum, and get through it and see, you know, where else to go. Alright, Volar gained XP. It's gonna send out... It has a Raichu? Wow, okay, I didn't... I never knew Volkner had a Raichu. What level is it? 46, that's nothing. I'm gonna go for an Earthquake. Only a level 46, dude? Come on, man. Your, your little trainers, that little girl had like 5 level 48 Pikachus. Wow, that was super effective. What the hell was that? Signal beam? That must have been ice or something because that hurt me by a lot. Alright, let's hope I can KO this Raichu here with the Earthquake I just threw out. Uh, here's hoping for me KOing it. Yes! KO! Two Pokemon in a row. Woo! Fantastic. I'm probably going to switch out to Linz though. Let Linz handle the rest. Um, because I've already KO'd two by myself with Speedy and Speedy's low. Alright, come on out, Linz. Linz, it's your turn to shine. Time for you to knock out the rest of Volkner's team. Finish off the last two for me so we can move on and, uh, kick up the rest of his, uh, Pokemon butts. So it has a Luxray. Wow, it's on 48. That's, like, better than my Speedy. Or Sparky. Oh, well, it's not better than my Sparky. My Sparky's probably KO'd more Pokemon than it has. So I'm throwing out the Earthquake. Hopefully it'll KO its little Luxray. Goodbye, you little cat thing. What?! Wow, only half health. Ice is going to be super effective on me. Wow, it is definitely prepared. It knew I was coming. It knew what I was going to bring, and it KO'd me. Wow, it really did KO me. Wow, that was not expected. I'm going to go ahead and send out... Man, who should I send out? Wow, okay. I'm going to send out Jerry. Jerry's going to have to tank it while I heal up uh, Linz to, you know, come out here and just kick some butt. Oh, well, no. Ice is going to be super effective on it. I'm going to go for a Fire Blast then. Uh, and hope that, you know, it does some, some serious damage to this Luxray. Or at least can get it down to like half. Because it's probably going to be the toughest one. You know, I got to admit, Luxrays are very strong. And there we go, I KO'd it. Good job, Jerry. Thank you very much for that. Really, really, really thank you, dude. That that, that was a little worry of mine. And it's going to send out Electivire. You know what? We're going to... No, we're going to we're gonna keep out Jerry. I'm pretty sure Jerry will be able to handle an Electivire. It's level 50? Oh my gosh, this is it. My trump card. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and revive. I gotta revive. I have to bring back, or, no, you know what, just heal up Speedy. What am I talking about? I'm gonna go ahead and heal up Speedy, and Speedy will finish it off for us. Why not, you know, finish this off with the person we started, the Pokemon we started, our strongest team member. Let's keep that ep epicness factor to it, and finish off Volkner, the 8th gym leader, with our starting Pokemon once and for all. Alright, it hit a crit on me. Jerry is down. Thanks for your efforts, Jerry, and it's time for the show. Right here, showtime. Here comes out Speedy, the boss himself, the one that we started with, my little Turtwig. Insert Turtwig montage here. Uh, he's going for the Fire Punch, which is going to be 
super effective on me. Hopefully it doesn't KO me, and all I can hope for is that this Earthquake can uh, take a good chunk of damage from it. Because if not, I'm going to have to hop back in here later, and then hopefully KO it. I'm hoping for a crit right now, but Electivire is pretty strong, so it'll probably be KO'd! Get out of here, Volkner! You can't take this! Get out of here! So we KO'd it. Goodbye, Volkner. We gained 10,000. No, 10,000. 1,065 XP. Volkner grew to level 44. I defeated Leader Volkner. You've got me beat. Your desire and the noble way your Pokemon battled for you. I even felt thrilled during our match. That was a very good battle. I got 6,000 for winning. And woohoo! We defeated Volkna! Hehehe. <laughs> that was the most fun I've had in a battle since I don't know then. It's also made me excited to know you and your team will keep battling to greater heights. This is your 8th gym badge. You've earned this. I received the beacon badge from Volkner! Yeah! Badge number 8! No more to go! The beacon badge lets you use the hidden move Waterfall, even when you're not in a battle. Waterfall happens to be the key if you're going to the Pokemon League. Also, because you've collected all the 8 badges, any Pokemon at any level will now obey you without fail. I want you to take this too. We obtained TM57! I put it away in my pocket. It is the move Charge Beam. It may raise special attack if it lands. It's electrifying. Let's talk to him one more time. Your next step is the Pokemon League Challenge. It's time for you to cross the sea and win your way through the gauntlet that is Victory Road. Demonstrate to the Pokemon League your mastery of your team. Against you, even the Elite Four will be pushed to, the, to fend off your challenge. So there we go. That was it. That was it. Was that all of the gym? That simple. We have at last defeated Volkner, the last of the gym leaders, once and for all. Let's go ahead and make our way out here. And woo, that was that was fantastic. I, I'm pretty sure we can just like run out of here now, can't we? Yeah, we should be able to. So that wasn't too bad. That, I was expecting it to be a little more of a challenge. But you know what? It was Volkner. So, you know, props to us for, you know, uh, having a good fight against him. Because Volkner is a fantastic gym leader. Probably the gym leader that I have the most respect for. So thank you guys so much for watching. In the next episode, we're going to make our way to Victory Road. Let me know some tips if you guys have them. I'm not completely sure what's going on next. So, you know, just let me know what's going on. Thank you guys so much for watching. Catch you in the next episode. Goodbye.